Okay, 2020, 579. This one is an in slate gray, guys. Um, this one's a prestige interior. This is a little bit more of a fleet spec. Might be a good truck for somebody who wants to transition out of their uh, used truck, you know, or a little bit older truck, and they want to make their first new purchase. Um, this one here, a little bit more price point. So you can see that slate gray. It's got a nice amount of flake in it. I like this color because it's one of the darker colors that shows less dirt. So this one is a 244 inch wheelbase. And we put the X15 Efficiency Series engine on this one. get a lot of comments on these efficiency engines um, guys some guys who've had some bad experiences with these uh, there's been parameters that were put on them that they may not be aware of that they can change and so uh, in the lower gears guys get they make them short shift at really really low rpms in the lower gears and uh, this one here we we set them up so that when they come here if you guys want to set those up for your trucks that's fine but we don't do that and so you can you can run the rpms as you see fit because you're the professionals this one is set up for shore power much like an rv it is a 80 inch high roof We did put fairings, 135 gallon tanks on this one. I believe on both sides. But you can see there's your inverter. And the controls for your inverter up there. As well as the S-bar heater. Disc brakes on the front, drum on the rear on this one. Just, we did do the battery jumper terminals on the back. So that if you got a jumper reefer or something, no problem. Peterbilt low leaf suspension and 24 inch haul and fifth wheel. Uh, some guys have been asking me why, how much savings do you get if you switch over to the aluminum fifth wheel or the no-lube aluminum fifth wheel. And it's about 155 pounds over the Holland F35. 22.5 rubber with the Peterbilt oval wheels. There's still a little bit of mag chloride. It, the, the truck's been washed, but it hasn't been detailed yet. We just got it out of out of PDI so if the wheels aren't a spit shine that's why it's running 308 rear gear sets and prestige interior on this one they did the rubber floors on the front cloth seats I want to point something out real quick. Uh, I've had a lot of views on my black ultra loft truck. <laughs> so the check engine light, a lot of people thought that it was on. And so I want to point out the truck runs a diagnostic and you will see that check engine light go out. I panned away from it on that video before the you could see the check engine light went out and I had a whole bunch of people point out the fact that the check engine light was on. Um, it is not Russia's common practice to put trucks out on the lot that have check engine lights from the factory. If I don't see it very often, but it does happen. Well, that's what our pre-delivery process is for. The 
Again, prestige interior, so this one's the gray. It is equipped with a fridge. And this one is a double bunk. bit slower you guys have asked me to take a little bit more time on this stuff we're getting really good at putting first-time owner operators in trucks you know if this would be a good stepping stone truck for you um, if you want me to kind of help you write the script on how you can do it and if you have questions about finance or anything else just give me a call this one does have the TV mount. It's just the standard closet. No business center in this one. So you can put your Tupperware or whatever you need in there. I said at the beginning this was a 2019 but this is definitely a 2020 model so if you guys have any questions on this truck or any other truck again my name is JW Rush Truck Center Southern Colorado if you want to call me direct or have any questions my number is 970-518-5520 I also wanted to add that I have one of these in white so if you're looking for a white one I have the I have one of those as well if you like these videos, go ahead and click on the button in the bottom right-hand corner and subscribe. We'd love to have you, and we'll talk soon. Stay safe.